experience is central to any notion of Southern heritage. And while black culture has been traded, stolen, borrowed in the most magical and pathological ways. Real social change takes place on the dance floor, the concert halls, the college classrooms, even in the military. John Sims is a really provocative artist. Um, he's from Detroit and I think for a lot of people, they were really, I think, uh, excited to see what he was doing with this sort of uh, play on, on flags, on history, um, how we're going to you know, sort of think about our emotional connection to a lot of things that we sort of take for granted to be flat entities. I don't agree with a man, I don't agree with his politics. He was, I think, a person who knew how to work a crowd, but at the same time he voted for the black male vote, not the black gay man vote. So I have my own problems with King. You just kind of have to tap into like the motives and, and why you're doing this, and if you're trying to appeal to the masses or if you're trying to actually like promote change, which I don't really think is always like the end goal, especially when like white allyship is very highly promoted as like a moral obligation when I don't think it is. But if real, real change is to come, it will come through the rituals of action, social responsibility, and respect.